All right, so the JV National History B 2015 National Championships, John Connor and Alex Schmidt. We'll do a buzzer check starting with John. All right, and Alex, there we go. So this is a first to 15 affair. First student to get 15 correct will win. There are no minus ones or any sort of other penalties for incorrect answers. We're just going to go until we have someone get 15 correct. Um, David, can I get another pen by any chance? Sorry. <laughs> Wait, I think another one. Yep. Sorry about that. So John and Alex. All right, are we ready? Yes. Is the echo thing good? Can you hear me clearly? Absolutely fine. Great. Thank you so much. Can you guys hear me out there? All right. Question one. This man hoped to be remembered as the acutest, astutest, archest enemy of southern slavery. This man died after... Charles Sumner. Charles Sumner's incorrect, I'm sorry. This man died after collapsing while shouting no about a bill to honor Mexican-American war veterans. This congressman convinced colleagues to use the funds from James Smithson's trust to create a scientific institution. James Madison appointed this man the first ever U.S. minister to Russia. He was the first president to serve in Congress after his term of office ended and assumed his highest office thanks to a corrupt bargain with Henry. John Quincy Adams. John Quincy Adams is correct, Alex, with the point. Two, the crime of smuggling this commodity out of the country was called owling. The Duke of Sutherland ordered some clearances to expand production of this good. The Cockaine Project attempted to ban the export of this commodity, which was traded by the merchants of the staple. Opium? Uh, opium's incorrect, I'm sorry. This commodity was soaked in stale urine by Fuller's. The seat of the Speaker of the House of Lords is a sack filled with this good, which was frequently exported to Flanders. For the point, name this commodity which is treated with carding and obtained from sheep. Wool. Wool is correct. Three, because of this event, the height of flimsy structures called insulae was restricted. People blamed for... Fire. More specific, please, than fire? Fire's in ancient Rome. Um, I'm going to... Um, more specific. Arson in ancient Rome. Uh, more specific. Arson which caused a great fire of Rome burning the city down. Correct. <laughs> the point. Thank you. Four. This team had a super fan named Carl Earhart who held up a sign reading, There Are No Words, after it won a title. This team won a game partially thanks to a shoe polish incident in which Cleon James claims to have been hit on the foot. In its first championship series, Ron Swoboda and Tommy Agee made brilliant catches. Nolan Ryan won his only World Series with this team, who star... The Astros. The Astros isn't correct, I'm sorry. Whose star pitchers included Jerry Kuzman and Tom Seaver. For the point, name this team which won the 1969 World Series, a miracle team that had lost 120 games back in its first year of 1962. Uh, that would be the New York Mets. New York Mets. Five. The wealthy Spring Valley neighborhood of Washington, D.C. is built over chloride compounds of this element buried by the U.S. Army after World War I. Peasants in Styria swallowed balls of this element to increase libido, inspiring a few Victorian copycats. A central atom of this element occurs in Paul Ehrlich's magic bullet drug, the first chemical treatment for syphilis. Its anion, when bonded to gallium, forms a common... Alex? Mercury? Mercury's incorrect, I'm sorry. Forms a common semiconductor in consumer electronics. The Marsh test detects this element. For the point, name this extremely toxic metalloid used in Victorian England as an over-the-counter rat poison. Arsenic? Arsenic is correct. Question six. 
An assuredly fabricated solution to this mystery involves the New York banker Irene Bolam. A 1966 Fred Gerner book about this mystery quoted Naval Commander John Pillsbury. Chester Nimitz was quoted as saying the answer to this mystery involved people being captured by the Japanese in the Marshall Islands. Outlandish solutions to it involved participants working as spies for Franklin Roosevelt before... Bermuda Triangle. Uh, Bermuda Triangle is incorrect, I'm sorry. For Franklin Roosevelt before World War II. This mystery involves what happened to Fred Noonan and a Lockheed Model 10. The disappearance of Amelia Earhart. The, the disappearance of Amelia Earhart is exactly correct. Question 7. This king's second wife was the subject of the encomium M.A. Regine. The Archbishop of Canterbury, El Theha, was pelted to death with bones during the reign of this king, who... Guthrum. Uh, Guthrum's incorrect, I'm sorry. This king, who arranged an uneasy alliance with Thorkel the Tall. This king arose to the, thr rose to the throne after his mother, Elfthrith, allegedly arranged the murder of his predecessor in Corf Castle. During his reign, Beirthnoth lost to Viking invaders at the Battle of Malden. He ordered the killing of all Danes in England in the St. Brice's Day Massacre and was succeeded by Swain Forkbeard. For the point, name this English king whose epithet comes from an old English word meaning bad counsel. Ethelred the Unready. Ethelred the Unready is correct. Question 8. A member of this group was shot and killed while assisting Leila Khaled in hijacking El Al Flight 219 in 1970. PLO. Uh, PLO is incorrect, I'm sorry. This group founded the newspaper El Nuevo Diario after the publication La Prensa criticized them. Despite this group's campaigns to improve literacy, the country it rules still has the lowest literacy rate in Central America. A national opposition union against this group was led by Violeta Chamorro. This group overthrew, overthrew the Somoza dynasty in 1979, and their members include Daniel Ortega. For the point, name this leftist party in Nicaragua. The Sandinistas. Sandinistas is correct. Question 9. A member of this group also served on the Quorum of the Twelve Apostles at the same time and later became president of the LDS in 1985. This group was called Eight Millionaires and a Plumber, as Eisenhower's cabinet. Uh, Eisenhower's cabinet is correct for Alex. Question 10. This man is the subject of several works by Ernest Meissonier. Apsley House is home to a sculpture of this man holding a staff and a miniature figure of Nike standing on an orb. He looks to the right at a man with the number 32 on his hat in a painting showing him surrounded by plague victims in Jaffa. The names Careless Magnus and Hannibal appear on rocks at the bottom of a painting of this man on a rearing white horse. The Duke of Napoleon, Napoleon is correct. 11. This man explained the theory of tides in his essay, Discourse on the Tides. This man's last book, The Two Sciences, introduces his paradox about, paradox about infinite sets. He included sketches... Descartes. Uh, Descartes incorrect, I'm sorry. Uh, he included sketches of the moon in his book, The Starry Messenger. He legendarily said, Epur si muovi, or And Yet It Moves, after his book, Dialogue Concerning the Two Chief World Systems. Galileo. Galileo is correct for Alex. Uh, I have six for Al six for Alex, three for John. That's not, I think I'm missing one in there. That's correct. Yes. Seven and three. That's what I have as well. Yep. Seven for Alex, three for John. Right now. Going into question twelve. Translations of this man's work by Harriet Martineau popularized his views in England. This man envisioned a set of worldwide temples modeled on Catholicism without God and his plans for a secular religion of humanity. The motto, Ordem e Progresso, on Brazil's flag, is translated from the writing of this man, who wrote that humanity progressed from the metaphysical to the theological stage as... Karl Marx. Karl Marx is incorrect. Theological stage as part of his law of three stages. For the point, name this French founder of the pro-science philosophy of positivism, who coined the terms altruism and sociology. 
Durkheim is also incorrect. We're going for Comte, Auguste Comte. Question 11. Sorry, 13. This man told Governor William Claiborne that he was the stray sheep wishing to return. This man was killed in an attack on the ship General Santander and previously served as the manager of the secret trades on the island of Barataria. He eventually began capturing slave ships from his colony. Edward Teach. Uh, Edward Teach is incorrect, I'm sorry. Uh, from his colony of Campeche on Galveston Island. This man with his older brother Pierre met with Andrew Jackson in December 1814. John Lafitte. John Lafitte is correct. Question 14. The Kachak movement in this province was suppressed following the death of Azim Gallica. In 1981, student protests in this province led to the ouster of Mahmoud Bakali. Along with Vojvodina, this province had its autonomy rescinded in 1989. The failure of the... Kosovo? Kosovo is correct. 15. One member of this movement was executed for his supposed role in the conspiracy of the latter and wrote under the pseudonym Placido. Carlos Manuel de Cespedes issued the Grito de Yara before starting a 10-year war attempting to achieve this movement's aims. This movement gained traction in the United States due to... Cuban independence. Cuban independence is correct. Question 16. This rebellion lost power after... Yang Xu Qing's execution after Taiping Rebellion. Taiping Rebellion is correct. Question 17. The first book of reporter Randy Schiltz was a biography of this man, his close friend. This man's hope speech denounced the Briggs Initiative, which targeted certain public school teachers. His one-time intern was Unite Here activist Cleve Jones. The White Knight riots broke out after this man's killer successfully used the Twinkie defense at... Harvey Milk. Harvey Milk is correct. Question 18. A work by one of these people hails Richard I as the father of valor and describes his death as a very cruel event. A form of rhyming debate called a tenso was invented by one of these people named Sersamon. Dancers and jugglers called jongleurs often accompanied these people. Uh, traveling circus performers is incorrect. Uh, these people composed biographical songs called Vida and dirges called Plan. Eleanor of Aquitaine patronized several of these people, and her grandfather, William IX, was one of them. Bernard de Ventadour and Arnaud Daniel were prominent examples of these people. For the point, name these wandering poets of the Middle Ages. Troubadours. Troubadours is correct. Love the, love the flourish there. Question 19. This colony ceded the oblong to its western... Connecticut. Connecticut is correct. Wow. Question 20. This party expelled its left-wing 79 group in 1982. Winnie Ewing was this party's first member of parliament. It rescinded its opposition to NATO in 2012, and its current platform calls for a relocation of the Trident missile system. This party has since 2007 formed the government in... Liberal Democrats is incorrect, I'm sorry. Has formed the government in Holyrood and is currently headed by Nicola Sturgeon. Its longtime leader, Alex Salmond, stepped down after its failure to, to defeat the Better Together campaign in a 2014 referendum. For the point, what party is working to make the northern third of Great... Scottish Independence Party. I'm sorry, that's incorrect. That's the Scottish National Party, or SNP. Sure. That looks correct to me. Um, let's double check this one again. Yes, that's, that looks right. Again, first to 15 is what we're doing here. 21. This series includes an entry addressed to Guy Carlton asking him to give up your murderer. The author of this series discussed being at Fort Lee at the land by the Hackensack. This series claimed that tyranny, like hell, is not... Sorry, that's um, more specific. Thomas Paine's uh, pamphlet uh, uh, 
advocating the independence the, of the colonies. That's, that's uh, which, 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 which we sorry, it's time and, and incorrect, sorry. Uh, Sirius claimed tyranny like hell is not easily conquered and that the summer soldier and the sunshine patriot would shrink away. The first entry in the series begins with the line, these are the times that try men's souls and was read aloud before the Battle of Trenton. For the point, name this pamphlet series written by Thomas Paine to encourage Americans during the Revolutionary War. Common sense. Uh, no, that'd be the American crisis. The American crisis. 22. A 1990 performance of this album on Potsdamer Plots featured f flutist James Galloway during Goodbye Blue Sky. Its narrator laments, I've got fading roots in nobody's, nobody home, before reminiscing about wartime singer Vera Lynn. According to its primary songwriter, its central track is the anti-war song, Bring the Boys Back Home. At the start of this concept album, which was adapted into a film with animation by Gerald Scar, Yellow Submarine. A uh, Yellow Submarine is incorrect, I'm sorry. The protagonist, Gerald Scarf, the protagonist's father dies as a World War II pilot, an incident drawn from Roger Waters' life, which puts the first bricks into its title structure. For the point, in what Pink Floyd double album does a chorus of children proclaim, we don't need no education? Bloody Sunday? Uh, Bloody Sunday is incorrect. We're going for The Wall. The Wall. These people do get some education, though, so. 23. Bunny Greenhouse claimed this company engaged in some of the most blatant and improper abuse she had ever seen. A former head of this company was hit with corruption charges in 2010 regarding the building of a plant on Bonnie Island in Nigeria. This company's one-time subsidiary, Kellogg Brown and Root, had an employee... Halliburton. Halliburton is correct. 24. This many statues make up the monument to the eponymous heroes. A board of this many men were appointed to create the Twelve Tables. The Alexandrian Canon is a list of this many great Attic orators. In the Roman army, mutinous troops were punished. Ten. Ten is correct for John. 25. A 2010 court ruling about this city divided a holy plot of land into thirds, giving one-third to the Nimrohi Akhara sect. The legendary slayer of the demon Indrajit came from this city in a tale in which a pair of sandals was left on its throne. A 1992 bombing of the Babri Mosque in this city was linked to the Nationalist Party BJP. In a poem revered by Hindus, a prince... Mumbai. Mumbai is incorrect, I'm sorry. In a poem revered by Hindus, a prince exiled from this city for 14 years defeats the ten-headed Rakshasa, Ravana, to rescue his wife Sita. For the point, name the site of religious tension in contemporary India, regarded as the birthplace of Vishnu's avatar, Rama. Delhi. Uh, Delhi's incorrect, I'm sorry, that's Ayodhya. Ay Ayodhya. All right, that's a thing. 26. One senator from this state was called the senator from Formosa for his support of Chiang Kai-shek. That person from this state became the youngest ever majority leader following the death of Robert Taft. Another person from this state won an election against Helen Douglas for senator. California. California is correct for John. Question 27. A poem named for this location describes brutish necessity wiping its hands upon the napkin of a dirty cause. A poem named for this place, which is dedicated to the Sicilian king Robert of Naples, features historical events such as the death of Mago Barsid. A post-colonial poem named for this place describes Kikuyu, quick as flies, and was written by Derek Walcott. This place also titles a Renaissance epic which recounts Scipio's victory at the Battle of Zama. For the point, a poem by Petrarch is named for what continent? Africa is correct. For a score check, I have Alex at 13 and John at 8. That's what I have as well. We need 15 to win. 28. Since antiquity, mines in the Badakhshan region of Central Asia have by far produced the largest supplies of this good. Cutting this inorganic substance, which the ancient Romans valued as an aphrodisiac, 
produces an odor from the trisulfide radical anion that also gives it its color. Glass and this solid material make up the non-gold stripes of Tutankhamun's burial mask. During the Renaissance, artists such as Titian crushed this material. Lapis lazuli? Lapis lazuli is correct. So Alex, you need one more to become our JV national champion. Question 29. Pauline Sa Sabin founded a group to support this cause after hearing a speaker claim to represent the women of the United States. This cause was supported by the New York-based Molly Pitcher Club. The Colin Harrison Act accomplished one goal of this cause, which was backed by the Women's Moderation Union. John D. Rockefeller Jr. eventually endorsed this cause because of the unprecedented increase in crime. It was supported by... Prohibition. Sorry, that's incorrect. Uh, increase in crime. It was supported by people who felt the Volstead Act had simply resulted in bootlegging. For the point, name this goal accomplished by the 21st Amendment. Repealing Prohibition. The repeal of Prohibition is correct. And congratulations, Alex, our national champion.